hello friends welcome back to the next tutorial on web development so in this short tutorial the simple and easy tutorial I'm going to be showing you how you can add different classes to your elements on a web page or to a website now in the previous tutorials I showed you how you can use the append to function the clone function parent function and children function so in this tutorial we are going to be using animate.css so we are going to be adding those classes to our elements the ones you're seeing on the right hand side these buttons we are going to add classes to them using animate.css and if you can see on my left hand side where you're seeing this cursor i'm having a folder of animate and inside animate i'm having animate.css so i'm going to go ahead and include it in our project so in case you missed the previous tutorials i'm going to leave the links in the description below make sure you check them out and see how we came to create all these wells and nice looking buttons i'm just going to link so the href i said we have in this folder animate first write animate so forward slash so inside animate we are having animate.css write animate dot css guess that's it we have finally included the animate dot css file in our project come to zoom in so let's scroll down now uh, for this to work or uh, you can do it anyhow you want but i'm going to add classes to these elements and it's going to be the same target so every element or button is going to be having this class target target so to put different types of different classes to your element you just have to space them target and also this one target now let's go to the jquery the dollar sign so we target the class which is target so every element that is having a class of target we are going to add this class add class and if you have ever used animate.css write a class you first begin with animated and also the type of the class like shake and everything on the web page is going to shake as you can see so everything we have added that class shake to every element that is having this class target but we can go ahead and specify the element you want to animate like right now we want even so those elements that that are in the even more than you, you can see in the even position so those are the different buttons that are in the even position you can also add those one in the odd As you can see those ones the old position will animate how cool it is there is also you can use the in child in child and you need the third one As you can see having a class and you are the third one you will animate so you can go ahead and specify the buttons you want to shake you can see these ones are in the second position so target is child the second element i guess you are getting that basic knowledge on how you can select different types of elements and add classes to them but now let us stick with the even and odd i want to show you for you guys who are lost there's also another anim animation called hinge so this one is going to show us the different we are going to remove the even elements from the web page so that you understand them as you can see so the even elements are removed and we have remained with the odd elements 
So those elements that are in the odd position will stay and the ones in the even position will be hinged away or removed away. The same applies to odd. As you can see, those ones in the odd position will be removed away. So guys, that's it for this tutorial. How simple it was. I'm going to make sure I leave the links in the description below in case you missed the previous tutorials. Now, since we are done with our code, everything we wanted to learn about jQuery, I'm going to target the body and I'm going to add this class of hinge. So everything on my page will be removed away or thrown down into the trash. As you can see, they are removed and thrown into the trash. So thanks for watching guys. I'll see you in the next tutorials. How cool. This <laughs> so nice. So things being thrown away in the trash. Make sure you subscribe guys if you learned something in these tutorials.